Today we are finally going to be adding an angler fish that I'm gonna buy off the web to this tank right here. Obviously you guys know the Gorilla Rock Structure tank. You guys, it's a fan favorite, it's a fan favorite. We gotta fix that. The cuttlefish are doing great in their little net. We'll give an update on those guys. But the most important thing, we are gonna be ordering an angler fish for this tank today and I am pumped about it. First thing we gotta do is fix my gorilla rock structure. Hold on, we gotta show him the form again. So do you see how it's a headless gorilla? So he's like this, you know, he's a gorilla, he got the arms and the butt. We gotta get the head back, you know? Just thought I'd show everyone and demonstrate. So let's put this thing, oh my gosh. I don't, how did this rock even get down here? Okay, hold on peeps. How's that, is the gorilla back? Let's go, the gorilla's back. The gorilla tank, let's go. They are back. Now, cuttlefish update. Guess what I can do right now? Take these eggs out because every single cuttlefish has hatched. Every single one. All, I think there might be eight to 10 in here. Check out the eggs, all deflated. There's not one that is still ready to get hatched. It's, they're all gone. Every single egg has popped, which is insane and they all like to hang out in this one little corner that I'll show you guys in a second, but we can remove these from the basket because all of them hatched. Now I took all the eggs out of the, oh, I can't remove that. I took all the eggs out of the basket, but I, what I wanted to do was remove the, like, see how I had the eggs on top of this like clear layer up here and then the basket on the bottom? I wanted to remove this basket so we can see them better, but I can't because it's actually attached to the ring. So all of them are hiding back in this corner here, way in the back. It's so hard to see in this net, guys. I think we need a whole dedicated cuttlefish aquarium. Let me know by dropping a like on this video if you guys think that should happen i think i'm gonna do it this week we need a whole dedicated cuttlefish aquarium imagine having a little tank and all these little baby cuttlefish swimming around instead of in here i think that's the move a couple of them are uh, you know waking up a bit and swimming around but there's like five of them lined up in the back here so every cuttlefish has hatched we did it i needed knuckles from you guys let's go we actually hatch them. Now feeding them is a whole nother thing. I fed them a bunch of brine. So we're going to see if they, you know, keep progressing with the brine or else I need to switch anything with that. But let me know in the comments, the best thing that you guys would feed the cuttlefish. I'm starting with brine, but who knows if there's something better, I will let me know in the comments. Cause I want these things to get at least like that big in the tank. That'd be, Oh my God, that would be so cool. Imagine feeding these guys crabs chef's kiss but we're adding an angler fish to this tank obviously not with the cuttlefish in there they're gonna be in their cage then we're gonna be upgrading the cuttlefish to a whole new tank now before we do all that good stuff we gotta find an epic angler fish online because there is so many different cool ones so let's try to find a really dope one that we can buy now there are some pretty insane angler fish out there in the world as you guys know we caught a sargasm angler fish the other day just the other day we caught one that lives in the sargasm so sick but there's so many different kinds that will actually blow your mind. And we're gonna look at some really cool ones today. And I feel fantastic today. I've been wanting to do this for a while. I feel great, got a lot of energy. And I gotta give a big shout out to Magic Mind for helping me get and stay nice and energized. Now me, Jack and Brooke have been trying Magic Mind for months now. They sent us a bunch of these right here a while ago. We've been drinking them and we absolutely love them. Brooke really, really loves them. I really, really love them. Me and her are drinking them the most. And you guys know I'm big on having a routine, especially a morning routine. So for me, it's perfect because I, every day I wake up, go to the gym, drink my Magic Mind, and it really helps me keep a sharper mind, steady energy, and way less stress. So it's very helpful. Now I drink these really quick and I'm ready to get energized for our, uh, for our angler fish adventure. Adventure. So cheers, magic mind down the hatch. Ah, it's really, really good. You guys gotta try it. It's delicious. So for me, the reason why I like this is I, I was always an afternoon coffee drinker and I really wanted to cut that out because you know, the cream and everything and the sugar, I really wanted to cut that out. And it works really well because of the nootropics inside like L-theanine and L-theanine is nature's time released caffeine, which is that's why, you know, I don't need to be drinking the afternoon coffee because of that. And it's found in matcha, which helps increase focus and attention. So drinking the coffee, like actual caffeine doesn't really give you energy. It just, it just blocks the adenosine neuroreceptors in your brain. And when they unblock a couple hours later, you get that big crash and then you got to drink the afternoon coffee. So that's why the, uh, the magic mind works great for me. Cause I can't be having those afternoon crashes. So I think of this as my little productivity shot. I just take a quick shot of this and I'm boom. I stop procrastinating. I'm back doing what I need to do. So if you guys do want to try it, there's a 60 day money back guarantee. So if you don't like it, you can get your money back free, but I guarantee you, you are going to like it. It's very good. If you guys do want to try it, go down in the description, click that link below. Use my special code fish guy. Chris to get you up to 56% off your first subscription for the next 10 days. So go down, click that link in the description, try the magic mind. You're going to keep that energy like this. It's going to be like that instead of like, whoa, it's going to be chill. So that's why it's a big, big plus for me. Magic mind. 
Now let's get into uh, checking out these angler fish because there are some seriously cool ones we can find. Now there are some pretty insanely cool looking angler fish, frog fish. Look at this bright red one and he's gonna eat a cardinal. That is insane. So look at the colors on this guy. Absolutely nuts. Literally that's the most vibrant red I think I've ever seen in an angler fish. That is absolutely gorgeous. One like this would be really cool for the tank. Oh my God, that's so sick. That is absolutely bad to the bone. Bad to the bone. Can you imagine me feeding an angler fish like a cardinal? That would be pretty nuts. What was this video at the end here? Look at that one. That one is absolutely sick. So there's so many different kinds that we can order, that we can get. And if we can get them small enough, we can get multiple. So we can get one now, maybe we'll get a bunch of rare ones. We'll just collect a bunch of rare ones in that one tank and then eventually they'll outgrow that tank. But look how gorgeous this one. So we went from all red to all white with some uh, red and orange on them. That is absolutely sick. That is the cool, that is one of the coolest fish I've ever seen. So it's crazy how, how different they, they can be, you know? They have all orange ones, all yellow. They have brown ones. We have a sargasm one. We have, you know, the white one. Because he has the white sand, he even pops. Oh, he's eating shrimp. Look at that. What a beast. What a beast. The frog fish, baby. And they walk along the bottom. That is so dang cool. That is 10 out of 10. Freaking cool, man. That is sick. Another video. This one's orange, but why are they just eating the cardinals? And how do the cardinals not see this freaking fish attacking them? Oh my God, dude. I swear at the store, those are like 50 bucks, aren't they? Aren't they like at least 40 bucks? Look at the slow-mo here. Boom, look how lightning quick that was. Snatched that thing up. So obviously ours isn't gonna be that big. I wanna get a really small one. So I'm gonna try to shoot for the really small, as smallest as possible. That way we can maybe get multiple of them and they won't, you know, they'll grow at the same rate. That is so badass. Does he eat another one? I think he eats another one. Look at this right here, another one. He's gonna eat another one. Oh, he tried to eat that one. That's insane. So we saw an all orange one, a white one, and an all red one. Now this one I saw, and I don't know what the heck this thing is. That is one of the coolest things. If I can find one of these, I will for sure get it. I never seen one before, never seen it online, never seen it at the store, never seen it anywhere. This is the first time I've ever seen one of these in my life. Look at that freaking creepy, hairy frogfish. I think this is a must. Drop a like if you think we need to get one of these. I think I'm gonna scour the internet. If you guys uh, find one, send it over to me on Instagram. I'll go check it out. But this is a weird looking anglerfish. Oh my God. Or frogfish, frogfish. We need one of these guys. We for sure need one of these guys. Look at the, look at that. It's a hairball. That's a 10 out of 10. That's a dime. I, I would definitely take this one over any of them. Look at that thing. Are you kidding? That's a, that's a freaking whale of a frogfish. That would be cool. This one I do see all the time, a little bit of lower quality video, but I do see these ones all the time, the yellow and pink ones. They're pretty cool. I definitely would get one of these guys as well. Yeah, yellow and pink is pretty sick too. There's so many options. Comment below your favorite your favorite one out of the bunch and then I'll read all the comments and see which one you guys want me to get because there's just ton of cool ones. That thing is sick. That thing is absolutely dope. All of them are mind blowing. I can't believe that thing's a real living fish. And then this guy, just a yellow, yellow. Oh, he's got two in there. He's got a yellow and he's kind of got the pinkish yellow one as well. It's crazy how they walk along the bottom and walk along all the rocks. It's freaking awesome, man. I don't know which one I want. I don't know which one we're gonna try to get, guys. I don't know. I think I really want that hairy one. I wonder if there's one for sale. Should we look really quick? This website has an all black one, but there's no fun in that. Three and a half inches, yeah. So he's not even in stock. They have an all black one that's not in stock, but cool, but I don't think I want that. Is this what that is? Is this what that was? I don't know, That's the, that one's such a baby that, I don't know, I don't know. I'm gonna try to find that hairy one. That's the one I want. I want this thing right there. That's the one I want right there. That hairy, creepy thing. Oh, I can't find it. I can't find a hairy one, guys. I cannot find a hairy one. That would be crazy to, uh, to get. That thing right there, that would be crazy to get. I want that. If you find one, let me know, but we're gonna have to pick what we you know we get we, we got slim pickets here we got to pick what we can get okay so i'm gonna check around online find one we're gonna order them up and we are gonna unbox them for the tank hopefully we can find a really cool one so we shall see right now my top favorites are right now my top favorites are all red like really red white and hairy those are my three favorites right now so i'll try to find one of those get them for the tank let's see what we can get baby i'm pumped Guys, we're back. A couple days later, the package has arrived. Sadly, my brother had also ordered a new Xbox controller in the mail. Package about yay big. So we decided to open it and he ruined our surprise. So we have the bag right here. I'm just gonna rip it and grip it and show you guys because we missed out on the unboxing experience, which is fine. We're still gonna unbox him technically right now. Now this guy is, he's perfect. He is perfect. We need a name for him. As you guys are looking at him, spam 
just spam down the, in the comments, a spam. I want a hundred different names to choose from. We have Tiny Tim the Anglerfish in here. We need a name for his older brother because this guy is so cool. He's so cool. Check him out in the bag. We're gonna put him in this container here. I have extra minnows. We're gonna try to feed him. Guarantee you he will eat in the container. Look at this angler. He's bright red, straight red, red with white spots. Absolutely sick. We saw some awesome angler fish on the internet yesterday. Super, really rare ones. I think I'm gonna try to get a bunch of really, really rare ones. This guy's kind of just the red version, which is also a very highly, people really like these guys, the red ones. Bright red, absolutely sick, but there's some crazy ones we can buy. So we're gonna keep our eyes peeled on those guys if you wanna see multiple angler fish in a tank. But even through the bag, he's about two inches. No, he's gotta be there. Three inches. I say with the tail extended, about three inches. Little dude, but a freaking beast. We need awesome names for him, dude. Like, isn't there like a red version of Hulk? Like, what's his name? Red Hulk or something? I don't know. Drop the crazy names down in the comments. Oh, I can't wait to see this guy in the container. We've gotten them before in the past and they eat right away. So we need a legendary name for this guy because they get big and we're gonna grow this guy to the moon. So let's see, let's see him in his container. It's gonna be wild. Let's see him in his container and we'll see where we're at. Remember, you don't need to spam a name right now, but as you're looking at him, really, really get, feel a connection with this fish and say, what is your name? Really feel that connection and then we'll pick a name in the next video. But these guys are known to have the best personalities. They really don't care about anything. You could probably pick them up out of the water, hold them in your hand like this, put them back in a tank, and they'll probably eat within 10 seconds. So these guys are some of my favorite fish to keep. Highly recommend getting them, but only if you're gonna get just the one, you know, with no other fish in there. Look at this guy. So let's see this guy. Let's get him in his container right here, and we're gonna really check him out. Oh my God, he's so cool. Oh my God, he's so cool. Holy cow, that is such a sick angler. Let's go, baby. We finally did it. I'm gonna acclimate him slowly right now and we're gonna look at him without this yellow water. I think, I think we're gonna just slowly get that yellow water out. So look at this guy, guys. Will he let me hold him? Should I try or should I try to feed him first? Okay, we're gonna try to feed him first and then I'm gonna pick him up so you guys can see the size compared to my hand. And as we're gonna acclimate him, just for fun, just cause we've done it before in the past, let's scoop some of my minnows from my little live well here that I feed Tiny Tim in. There's a, there's a fly in it as well. I'm, I guess I have flies in here. Let's see, that's a lot but we'll just try it. Let's see if he wants to eat something. Okay, ready? Splat him in. There's no way, right? Oh my God, is he? Is this thing moving? Oh my God, he's eating right away. He's freaking eating. That's insane. That's actually insane. Is he gonna get another one? I cannot believe he just ate right away. That's actually the craziest thing ever. Let's freaking go. This thing is a freaking tank. Oh my God. Oh my God. I haven't even put him in the tank yet. Okay, he didn't like that. He didn't like that. But did you see that eat? That was insane. This guy's a beast, dude. I, I, I'm in love. I'm head over heels in love. Guys, we did it. We got our first red anglerfish. I am pumped. That was crazy. So this is just scratching the surface. He's not even close to being full. He did not like this fish at all. What even is this fish? Literally, I have no idea what this fish even is, but he did not like him. He's like, you know what? He don't taste good. He likes the minnows though. He already ate a couple of those. That is so sick. Let's acclimate this guy and then get him in the tank. See how he looks. It's time for the gorilla tank to get its first member. Let's go. I'm gonna try to hold him. Let's go. He's such a beast. I, I'm in love. I'm absolutely in love. Okay, so come here, Mr. Buddy. Right now your name is just Mr. Buddy. Oh my God, beautiful. Look at that gorgeous dang angler fish. So sick. Let's get him in his tank. Here we go. Here we go. Where are you gonna go, buddy? Where are you gonna go? You gonna swim down? Go swim down. Let's go. We need a sick name for this dude. Let's go. What is he doing? Rook, come over here. Let's go. Let's put the light down. You're telling me that's not the coolest thing ever, right? You're telling me that's not the coolest thing ever. We can, I can get way more frogfish and, or anglerfish like this easily because he's gonna go right into the crevice. Let's go. I could easily get three in here that of the same size and I better do it quick. So let me know if you guys think, I'm gonna try to find the rarest one and just get them. That thing is so sick. I'm, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Yeah, I'm gonna see how his color changes because they do change their colors. So he was really bright red. We're gonna see if he changes to more of like a duller purple with the rocks here like that. So we'll see. Hopefully he stays that bright red because it's really cool, but you never know. Absolutely. Crazy fish, look at him hiding in there. Look at him hiding in there. Now the good thing is, we, we do have our cuttlefish in here, but there's no way of him to, of getting in and we're gonna be getting them out. I'm gonna get, get them out this weekend. I'm gonna get them in their own tank, I think so. I think that's gonna be a good idea. But I, I'm in love, guys. What do we name him? I mean, he's in the gorilla tank. He's the first fish in here. Should we just name him the gorilla? The gorilla, big red gorilla. I don't know, I don't know, we'll see. I need to, I need to just take my time in the comments. 
and pick the best one possible. But I am pumped. We have our little angler finally in the tank. He's our first guy in there. I'm ecstatic. Can't wait to share more feedings, showing him how he's gonna grow. It's gonna be awesome. Follow along the journey, hit the subscribe button if you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next one. Deuces.